it's Kimberly and today I am coming to you guys with a video that I'm literally so freaking excited about. I went to Sephora. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Yes, I went to Sephora and I bought a bunch of goodies and I'm so excited to show you guys what I got. Anytime I go to Sephora, I am so excited. It's like candy land. There's just so many pretty colors and so much stuff going on. You just want to run all around and pick up all the goodies. So I am so excited. And without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so the first item I picked up, which is, I'm going to say, the least exciting item out of all of them, is another Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray because I ran out of my makeup setting spray by Urban Decay and I love theirs. Last time I had Chill, which is like a dewy finish and this is like All Nighter, which is their long lasting makeup setting spray. I haven't used this one yet, but everybody loves this one. So I figured I'd give it a try, even though I did love Chill. I like to mix it up. So I got me one of those. Another item that I got that is exciting for me, but not probably for everybody else is May is my birthday month, so that's why I wanted to go. I had a bunch of gift cards and it's my birthday month, so of course I got my birthday gift. And I got to pick between a Bite Beauty gift and a Glam Glow gift. And as much as I would love to try the Glam Glow masks, I know that the Bite lipsticks I'll probably get more use out of and be able to use them multiple times. And you know, with the mask, I'm it sounds like fun, but I think I'll get more use out of this. So I got a little Bite Beauty Agave Lip Balm. Can just like one of those little dot things. It's got the, oh, it's the lip balm and the lip scrub. So it's a little treatment there, which is super cute. And then I got, I got a matte cream lip crayon. And this is in the shade Glacy G L A C E. I don't know what that is, but it's that really pretty, like pinky shade. And I'll do a little swatch there. Oh, that is so pretty. Oh my goodness. It's like a mauvey, dusty pink shade and it twists up. I'm so excited about that, oh my goodness. That is so fun, so I got that. And then I also got a Bite Boot, uh, uh, a Bite Beauty Amuse Bouche lipstick in the shade Chai. And that's the shade right there. Give a little swatch. Whoa, those are so similar. Um, so that's the lip crayon and then that's Chai, the lipstick. It's a little bit deeper, but it's fairly similar. But these are so creamy and like sticky. Smells good too. Um, not like sticky in a bad way, like lipstick, but like really like wet and like feeling it's not stiff and hard it's I really like that and I love the shape of their little bullets they're so cute so that's what came in my birthday gift and the next two things I got off of a recommendation from Jacqueline here here on YouTube she's been loving this as her foundation so I decided that I wanted to get it and give it a try and it's two foundations mixed together. So I got the Dior Skin Forever foundation and I got this in the shade 025 Soft Beige. I'll show you the bottle. It is so pretty. Can you see it there? Oh my goodness. It's like this, I love things in square bottles. I don't know why that is so appealing to me, but I love things in square bottles. And this is just like so pretty. It has SPF 35 shine control. It's perfect makeup, everlasting wear, pore refining effect with sunscreen. And it's 
one fluid ounce, which is pretty typical for foundation. And it comes in a pump, which I love a pump on a foundation. There's nothing worse than having to dump it out and wasting so much product. And yeah, I've never owned anything from Dior. So I am so excited to give, I actually, most of the brands that I got, except for the Urban Decay, I have not used before and I'm so excited to try things from different brands and just different products that I've never tried before. So yeah, this is step one with her foundation routine and I also got step two, which is the Hourglass, la, 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 uh, hourglass Vanish Stick. So that's so exciting. Also have not used Hourglass before. And it's such a cute little package. It's like a triangle which is so cute. I don't know if you can see it. it says hourglass there and it just pops open and you can twist it up and it's a foundation stick, which I've never used stick foundation before. I've only really used like liquids and powders, but never stick. And I was swatching this in Sephora trying to, you know, find my shade and whatever. And I thought it was going to be so like stiff and I thought like maybe this was going to be kind of hard to work into the skin but it is so creamy like when i glided it onto my skin i was surprised how like not firm like how soft it was and like blendable like i went with my finger and blended it out like i am so excited to try these together and i can only imagine putting liquid over the stick is going to make it even easier to blend out and i am so excited i love all of jacqueline's recommendations and I'm just over the moon to try this. So, so those are the next two things that I picked up at Sephora. Next, I had to jump on the bandwagon because literally everybody and their mother loves these things. And I want glitter so bad to put on my eyes. I don't want glitter so bad, but every time I see glitter, I'm like, mm, it's nothing. It doesn't impress me, you know? And to go in with a glitter glue and then pack it on, like it's so much. So I went and picked up one of these, well, I actually got two, the Stila Glitter and Glow Liquid Eyeshadows. Oh my goodness. When I swatched these on my hands, my heart melted. I got in the shade Diamond Dust and Gypsy. I believe Gypsy is 2018 Summer Limited Edition but it's so pretty. I'll swatch both of them for you. Diamond Dust is a silver shade and I wear silver a lot on my eyes, so I thought that that would be a good shade to start me out with. I definitely want to get more of these. Like, they're so amazing. I want to get a bunch of them. Look at that. How pretty, oh my goodness. And again, it comes in a square bottle because that's literally amazing. And then it has this doe foot applicator on it. And it just like, I don't know if you can see, hold on. Oh my goodness, can you, oh my goodness. It's like, do you see it there? My lights are so bright. It's like hard to see things, but it is stunning. Like, oh, oh. it's so pretty and it's just like a true silver shade and it's just like blinding oh my gosh i'm so excited to put that on my eyes and then i also got gypsy which i said was the limited edition summer 2018 color there are three of the colors but this one is what i thought was the prettiest the other ones were kind of like bronzy shades this one is like i don't even know it's like shifts between like purple and silver and like it's iridescent it's like everything and I don't think that it's gonna pick up on camera okay this is the shade right here and yeah hold on I turned my light off, I really don't think that that helped much, but there's the silver, and then there is like the pinky purple, the gypsy. I don't think that super helped, but if it did, at least you got to see both. Ah! And so, yeah, that is those two glittery shades, and man, I wish 
it was a little dimmer in here because they are beautiful and the camera is not giving them their moment. Oh my God. Anyway, those are probably two of the most exciting things I got that I'm super excited for. Actually, I'm excited for all of it, but this next thing, which is the last thing, last but not least, is probably the thing I am the most excited for in this haul. I got a Natasha Denona palette. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look at her. I got the Natasha Denona Lila palette. I am so excited about this. It is such an expensive palette. I do not have anything Natasha Denona. Everybody loves Natasha Denona. Like their shadows are like such great quality and they're so beautiful and pigmented and smooth and creamy. And I was watching them in the store like, man, I want it so bad. Do I get it? Do I not? I am sure I will not be disappointed. Even though this is like incredibly expensive, I know that it's going to be worth it. So this is the palette. It's like a like faux leather kind of a deal wrapped around the outside. And then it says Natasha Denona Lila palette and it's like embossed into like the leather. And when you open it up, it has a big old mirror, which I'm gonna flip back. And then it has one of these plastic sheets that show you all the names of the shadows. Look at that. Oh my God. I love purple eyeshadow love purple eyeshadow i wore it to all of my proms love it i wear it uh, like all the time because i just think purple is one of those fun colors that is so easy to pull off and so anyway i really wanted to get this purple one but it also has like gold and bronzes it's just amazing i don't even I want to swatch it so bad, but like I don't even want to touch it and ruin it because it's just so perfect. And then it has little magnets, so it's a magnetic closure and oh my goodness, it's perfect. I will swatch some shades for you even though I don't want to touch it, just want to look at it, but you gotta know what it feels like, what it looks like. So here we go. Are we kidding okay so this is the purple shade amethyst that was really off center but look at how beautiful that is and i will do this gold shade right here which is magnolia beautiful and let's see purpure 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 that one it's like a wine shade oh that feels so soft the purple and the gold they feel soft but they also feel like a little dry crumbly not in a bad way but they do this one feels so buttery look at that right there what what is life? Oh my goodness. Anyway, and I'll do one matte for you guys. I'll do, oh, what do I wanna do? I'll do Per Se, which is this like taupey light matte color in the corner. so beautiful oh, I am so happy I bought it I love it it's I haven't even put it on my eyes yet and I love it I know I love it that is all that I got in my Sephora haul today I hope you guys loved watching it I am so excited to try out these new products and really put them to the test I cannot wait I'm just like to the moon about it so anyways if you like this video please give it a thumbs up 
and subscribe and I will see you all next time. Bye.